All right. Well, hello. Hello. We look cute. Too cute to prostitute. Oh. <laughs> Okay. But we support sex workers. Yes. <laughs> lots of fun, honestly. Like, great conversation. Yeah, with good all times. <laughs> Hope is gonna be fun. Hilarious. I'm pretty I, excited about it. So we're gonna go through an article. Um, the website is called 29secrets.com um, and the article is called Beauty Trends Guys Hate. Guys Hate. How do we feel about that title already? Um, well, it's not positive. Let's get real. <laughs> Why the fuck do I care what you hate? No. Absolutely not. No, no, so we're no. gonna go through the article and we're going to read some of the they have like quotes from guys that they've shown the pictures of whatever trend it is and uh, Yeah, let's uh, let's have some fun. Wow. I will link the uh, the article below. Oh, yeah, well. yeah, yeah, and it's not like a Like slandering the website. No, no, no. it has nothing to do with the website. It, it has to do with the fact that like Women have it in their brain that they have to think about this. Mm -hmm. When really, we should just do whatever we want, do whatever makes us happy. Yeah. Respect, like, if you want to do some weird ass shit to your face or your hair, yeah, do it. You just gotta do what you gotta do to make yourself happy. Like, you look in that mirror, damn girl, you look fine AF. There's a mirror over here. There's a mirror. I mean, there's a mirror over there. There's a mirror over there. <laughs> um, because, you know, the mirror's in my head. You know? First trend. Ombre hair. We both have this. We both have this. Yeah. We both have it. Balayage, whatever you want to call it. Not a fan. It looks like the girl has not got her hair colored in years. Years. Um. First of all, don't give a fuck if I haven't got my hair colored in years. That's not your problem. Also, have you ever colored your hair? No, probably no. not. Unless you did frosted tips in the '90s. Let us do our frosted tips now. It looks cheap, ugly, and overall unattractive to me. I'm probably unattracted to you. Do I give a shit if it looks unattractive to you? I just don't understand ombre hair. You couldn't decide on one hair color, so you wanted to use two and call it ombre. I call that a fail. I call you a fail, sir. Straight and flat ombre looks completely dumb and reminds me of a Yorkshire Terrier at a dog show. Ooh, honey, you know what? Purebred, I like it. Champion of the kennel. Oh. <laughs> Bitch realness. <laughs> Bold lipstick. Ooh. Tell me how you feel about bold lipstick. Tell me. Tell me to my bold lips how you feel about <laughs> bold lipstick. But honestly, like, I've, like, gone on a date with, a, like, with, well, I do all the time with bold lips. And, like, you know what? If you don't care that my orange lipstick is going to get all over your face, I don't, like, I don't care. I don't but also, if you're going to comment on our bold lips, then that lipstick isn't going to get all over your face. Ooh, yeah. And isn't that what we want now? You want the... <laughs> Uh, comment. No, oh. it looks like you're trying too hard. What? It's or not. It's not. It's literally just like, oh, I really like that red. I'm going to put it on my lip. Wow. It looks like you've dipped your lips into candle wax. I mean, lipstick is literally wax. Okay. I'll take, I'll give you that one. I guess it's literal. Um, bold lips for the future and for now. Yeah. <laughs> How am I supposed to make out with you? It's really easy. Uh. <laughs> no one has ever minded. I don't, no one's ever complained. We'll get lipstick on your collar. Oh, yeah, it's not supposed to be like a sexy thing. Or to your husband thing. But like, maybe that could be your fantasy. Yeah, exactly. Ooh, yeah. This one's fun. Um, bold eyebrows. <laughs> that's definitely like a new trend. Yeah, but also bold eyebrows. It's just like, that's your brow. Yeah. Uh, unibrow. Like, okay, that's everyone. Men and women. Uh, yeah, also like, don't even talk to me about unibrow if you yourself do not pluck because Good point. You're gonna fret it. It feels like razor blades on your face. <laughs> I was like, no, 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 you don't get to tell all women what they should do with their body hair. Oh. Is that not a double standard? Are we living in a time of like just double standards? Oh, 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 oh. You know okay. what, Steve? I can do whatever I want. Thanks, Brendan. Thanks, George. I know all men with those names and they're quite lovely. <laughs> Thanks, Jason. Jason is a douche name. Thanks, Thanks Chad. Chad. Oh, that's my cousin. Dang, <laughs> really, he's, he's, out very, here. he's very feminist. All right, well, you know what I'm saying. You seem like 
a genuine, lovely person. I'd like to get to know you. Yeah, despite your eyebrows not being my style. Whatever. Next one. Crazy nail art. Is it crazy enough for you? Focus. Yeah, focus. <laughs> like, <laughs> sucker. That's too much. Too crazy. Too crazy. Oh, I wonder what you could do with those. I'm like, I don't know, scratch your eyes out. <laughs> then it gives them a reason to like grab your hand and hold it and then be like, oh, wow, this is really lovely. Well, not according to this article. Well, these guys don't get dates. What? They're too afraid of all these women, so they're just like complaining about it. <laughs> Stuck a nerve. Gross, if I want to watch porn, I'll go on the internet. Nail art to that extreme is just a cry for attention. These people are porn star wannabes. What does nail art have anything to do with porn stars, first of all? <laughs> Second of all, love porn stars, respect them, whatever. Yeah. What is the connection between nail art and porn stars? I don't... I'm sorry, but when has a man been grossed out by porn? Yeah. What? Accurate. We all know you watch it. Like, you're like, ugh, look <laughs> like a pornographic. Yeah. Gross. Ew. Um, lifestyles of the rich and the hopeless. <laughs> I mean, I am kind of hopeless. And I am kind of rich, so... You shouldn't judge about people about where they come from. It's all about where they're going. And it's not <laughs> going down on you. <laughs> That's a good one? That's good. <laughs> Sorry. Candy colored hair. You know, a lot of people have this sweet tooth. Well, I like a little cotton candy here and there. I have had people come up to me and eat my hair, but they were drunk. <laughs> if you come up to me to eat my hair, I will punch you in the face. I get a lot of people just like coming up and touching my hair. Mm. And like, consent, you guys, consent, honestly. Like, this is my personal, it's like, I don't know, people get really excited, I get compliments on the street. Oh wait, it isn't a wig? Very natural. Wow, I can hear the sarcasm dripping from your mouth. If I wanted the natural look, I would have the natural look. I would just grow it like a normal person. You're never gonna get a man like that. Oh, oh that's my only goal today? <laughs> like literally it. If I get a man, I could just give up. I could yeah. just like throw myself off bridge because like that's that's my goal. That's I would go. Spread the love. Girls supporting girls. Yeah. And not these dudes that are just bringing us down. Yeah, unnecessary. Like why are you unnecessarily being mean? If you have nothing nice to say, don't say it. Keep it to your damn self. Like, we don't dress for you. It's for my entertainment. When you look in the mirror, like, are you smiling? Because I know we are. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, if you want to have weird nails, have weird hair color, have ombre hair, that's not even weird. Yeah. Um, you shouldn't be doing it for men or or uh, a gender that you're attracted to. You should be doing it to yourself, like, for yourself. Mm-hmm. You it's know? about uplifting yourself. Like. This makes me happy. Yeah. It's like my life force, you know? You just have to do like what makes you happy, what makes you feel confident about yourself. And um, I think that will just be really great for you. And honestly, when you see a girl who has done something really dope, dope nails, dope hair, dope makeup, Beautiful whatever, dress, yeah. Like, compliment her. But like, women supporting women, like, you see a girl with something cool, just be like, hey man, I love your eyebrows, they look great. That will you. literally make a girl's day, like, yeah, absolutely. No. And then she'll just smile and be great. Feel, yeah. Look good, feel good. Do what you want to do. Do what you want to do. Or if you don't want any of these trends, that's cool too. Yeah. Right? Like vanilla is also a very classic flavor. Yeah, there's literally nothing wrong with having like a, a brunette hair, you know, like nude nails, the whole thing. Like mm -hmm. do what makes you happy. Who's your girl crush? Okay, so my girl crush right now is an artist. Um, her name is Ashley Longshore. Um, you can find her Instagram, Ashley Long. I think it's Ashley Longshore art. If it's not, then I will um, link the proper one down below. She is so funny. Her art is so dope. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay, and it's okay. like so yeah. sparkly and so um, like outlandish and like provocative. Oh, I love it. Whoa. <laughs> That's provocative. It gets the people going. Oh my gosh, she gets me going. Good. Yeah, 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 she jazzes me up. Awesome, that's what girl crush is supposed to do. Again, I'm gonna do a real person, like not, okay, everybody we've done is real, but a not Are you real? famous person. Are you real? 
I recently, we were talking about bras earlier, I recently went and I got properly fitted at like an adult, like big girl bra place, you know, not Victoria's Secret, not La Senza. Uh, I almost cried because I've never had something like fit me properly. My girl crush is a girl that fit me, her name's Tara, she works at Forever Yours and thank you so much. You did so much for me and my girls and I appreciate you and you're dope. Give us a like down below. Leave a comment about um, trends that boys hate, that oh, you love. Oh yeah, if someone made a nasty comment to you or maybe like a backhanded comment about something about your appearance, you know, yeah. let us know, even if it's your dad. Thanks so much for watching. Yeah, we love you. We love you. We Hashtag appreciate you. we love you. Oh yeah. <laughs> Bye. Bye. What's her face? Effie? Ooh, Effie Trinket! She looked great. She looked great. She got those like tiny little lips. Love it. The monarchs on her hair. Honestly, like whenever I think of like if that's how the world is, and unfortunately I'll be like, I wanna go to the Capitol. They have fun fashion! I'm sorry, District 13. <laughs>